Hello everyone and welcome back to another video of WWE Top Slam 2017 and the WWE Great Balls of Fire pay-per-view cards have just been released and they didn't give me a notification so I am a couple of hours late but I've got to say um, the new update for this game is pretty much disappointing I'm not a big fan of it uh, mainly because there's a lot of changes that i am not a fan of which include that it doesn't show that a trade has been accepted or declined and other bits out which i will get into shortly but let's have a quick look at the great balls of fire pay view cards itself i'm not a big fan of the actual name i'm pretty sure most of you guys are not but if you guys like the name then let me know in the comment section down below but and make sure you guys hit that subscribe button um because i do uh, upload these that will be top stamp uh, videos um, more frequently in this channel and every month there will be two of these pack openings guaranteed because two pay-per-views per month obviously for Smiley and Raw and here are the vintage um, cards which don't look the best and you have to buy them you can't get them in packs and here are the ugly silver I don't even know versions and well, luckily we have the color versions available like these I think there's um, 21 in total, I believe, to collect. And yeah, haven't opened anything. We have 350, 100,000 coins in the bank. And they have released um, some diamonds, uh, which came with a new update. But we do get a free pack. And another reason why I hate the new update is because you don't show everything here. And you have to press this information button here, which is long. And in the old update, it showed everything there. Uh, but it is a one guaranteed color, base color, and one or two chance of getting another one. Basic, so we're gonna be getting one here, and um, hopefully we should finish the set in this one pack opening. First card is a Seth Rollins who will be taking on Bray Wyatt. Just the one in that pack opening, but he has the other cards. I'm, I'm just gonna go straight into this. 7.5k. We have a lot of money to spend, so let's whiz through this. Our uh, next card is one half of the team extreme of and one half of the Hardy boys, Matt Hardy. Um, now I'm just going to speed through this and um, yeah, make sure you guys go check out my main channel, um, which is as in my books and reviews, um, if you guys are interested, Jeff Hardy, um, right there, with, with what the? And um, let me know in the comment section down below if you guys want me to do a predictions for the Great Balls of Fire pay review. And um, next up, Dean Ambrose, who will be taking on uh, the Miz for the Intercontinental Championship. So we haven't yet um, to get any duplicates, which is obviously great, but I'm definitely going to be getting some here, I can tell. But um, I forgot what I was going to say right now. We do get Big Cat, obviously, he's turning heel. And oh, double one. Um, Akira Tazawa taking on the Cruiserweight Champion um, Neville. And um, we can't get any signatures in these packs, unfortunately. And yeah, I was, I was gonna say, make sure you guys go check out my main channel. Obviously, um, Elias Samson there. Not a big fan of him, he's kind of boring. But yeah. I do unboxings, reviews, and if you're into that, then make sure you guys go check it out. Our uh, first duplicate, Akira Tazawa. Another one, is this a need? I'm guessing it is. The Miz, the current IC champion, who's most likely going to retain the Intercontinental Championship this Sunday. And. Do we get a need? Come on, kind of slow. My internet is not the fastest today, but it is Alexa Bliss. Do we get a double? I'm guessing not. Do we need get anything in that? Anything else in that previous pack? So yeah, another Seth Rollins. And please let me know. Um, in the comment section down below if you guys actually watch these full videos i will be very impressed and yeah 
I would I do appreciate those people who watch these entire videos are full length. I know some of these can be long now a big cast there. That we've got anything else. Only six cards in this um in these packs more like. Do we get a need? Come on, who is it? Roman freaking Reigns is going to be taking on Braun Strowman in an ambulance match. I'm not a big fan of the ambulance match. It's quite boring. Do we get another need? Um, sorry about that. Roman, I would vlog. Who doesn't watch Roman? I would. One of my favorite YouTubers. Come on. Okay. We do get Enzo Amore, which is a need. So that was probably the best pack in this pack opening. Yep. Let's see. Hopefully this video is under one hour, um, not one hour, what the flip am I saying, come on, under 10 minutes. Who did you get? Seamus, first time we got one half of the Raw Tag Team Championship. And um, oh, we get him again. Can we get Cesaro? Can we get a need? Who is it? Come on! Goldust, nice, a need. Uh, I, I don't know if, go, if he's going to be taking an R Truth in the pay per view itself, but um, I think it will be added on, uh, even though it hasn't been announced. But it can be a double kickoff show. Uh, what am I saying? Double kickoff match uh, with uh, obviously the Cruiserweight Championship match. Uh, I have heard some rumours that. It is going to be moved to the main show and probably might have Finn Balor against Elias Samson as well because they haven't been announced and Goldust and R-Truth. We do get the Cruiserweight Champion Neville and so Amore can. So we have wasted over 105, 100,000 goddamn coins. But after this pack I'm going to pause it and then skip through it. Alexa Bliss because I think it's gonna be a bit boring now okay that was the next pack but we do get the Universal Champion Brock Lesnar we haven't yet um, to get his opponent which is obviously some um, so we have wasted 150 100,000 coins and we haven't got any more needs apart from that Brock Lesnar card so let's actually have a quick look at um, the cards that we need and hopefully it is not a lot so we're yet to get these cards and it is a bit so we do need um seven more cards so hopefully we can get them in the next few packs so we get our next needy it has been quite a long time since we've got a need Braun Strowman um, he's gonna be taking on Roman Reigns in the ambulance match and it is and um, let me know in the comment section down below if you guys prefer um, um, having these longer uncut videos or if you guys preferred me pausing it and um, after a while and showing you the highlights. Um, yeah, let me know in the comment section down below. As you guys can see, I have been getting a lot of dupes and we just need six more cards to finish off the set. We do get our next need, some more Joe after two packs. And he's going to be taking on Brock Lesnar. The game. What on earth? Come on, what the? I let you guys be a judge of that one. And yeah, um, there is the two hundred thousand coins mark we have wasted. Um, come on, can we get some more needs? I think we need four more, I believe. But I am going to be ending this pack opening um, after I reach one hundred thousand coins. So after that other need, I didn't even get a single um, card that I needed. I wasted like five packs and I got legit nothing. So this is the last pack and we get Finn Balor, which is a need. And he's most likely going to be taking on Elias Samson in an unannounced match. There he is, this waste my going a million times, but that's going to wrap up the video. I want to keep this video on 10 minutes and let's have a quick look and update on the cards that I need. 
we need four more cards. Anyways, thank you very much for watching. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and let me know if you guys stayed here until the end in the conversation down below. Peace out. You guys are awesome. Make sure to subscribe as well.